YouTubers, and today we are going to make the Bubble Bubble Ball, and today, um, if I, I could, I really want you guys to feel this, it's really stretchy, it feels like a rubber band, do you, do you hear that? Okay, so I'm going to tell you what you need, you're going to need a Bubble Bubble Ball, and you're going to need the instructions, when I first tried it out, I'm like, oh my god, it got so sticky, the instructions stick to it, when I went to go to the instructions off, it literally ripped the instructions, and I cannot tell you how sticky this is, so you're gonna need a little bubble ball, Vaseline, one cut, um, You're gonna find this hole and then you're gonna wipe the Vaseline right in. Your Vaseline, your Vaseline, I mean the Q-tip might just accidentally slip in, but the Vaseline will help the this go right through quicker because you need the Vaseline. So then you're gonna poke this through here, make sure you don't break it. And I cannot tell you, and this is how big I could make it up to. I could do it bigger, but I are, it took my breath away. Like, literally, my breath. I can barely even breathe. It's really bouncy and jiggly, but when it's smaller, it doesn't bounce like this. If you drop it on the floor, it's just going to start rolling everywhere, and you have to run to catch it. But let me show you how sticky it is. Instructions on here. Rips. Oh, and it says that it's not dishwasher safe, but you can wash it by hand if it does get dirty. But if it does have a hole in it, you could just fix it up with any clear tape or any strong tape. So it says in the instructions that, let me find which instructions. Okay, it says here cleaning that if your tiny wobble bubble gets dirty we recommend that you deflate it and wash it in your sink with a tiny bit like one fourth a drop of your hand soap and cold water because if it's hot water um it will just this is really fragile, so if you do put it in hot water, it will get even more fragile than it already is. So, yeah, I'll show you how to clean it. Let me just deflate this, and I'll get straight to my sink. Okay, so here we are in my bathroom. So, again, you're going to need one-fourth. Here it says one-fourth. This is a teaspoon. So, I'm sorry, that's my family over there watching TV. Okay, so you're going to need any hand soap you have. This is my, um, 
Glossious Vanilla Liquid Hand Soap. Because it has ghost in it. A fourth teaspoon. The sink. I'm oh, sorry, the sink. And the wobble bubble. So what you're going to do is that you are going to take your soap and fill it up to the top here. Like that. So then you're going to put a little bit of spray on your wobble bubble. Hold on. So then you're going to turn on your cold water and wet the wobble bubble. And then what I like to do is drip all the hand soap onto here. Wait, hold on. Let me move the actual hand soap. Ooh. I'm sorry if the TV show curses. I'll maybe edit that out. Okay, so there I have it. And now you're just going to wipe it around until it gets all very bubbly. Like how mine is get, starting to get. So probably like that. I don't know exactly yet. Doesn't say how long you need to wash it, so I'm just gonna wash it for like a minute and then hand soap, and then I'll get straight to the um. A minute is almost done. I'm looking at my camera right now, and let me just turn on the water right now. And it's been a minute already, so I'm trying to wash. It doesn't take that long to clean it. Really? Yeah. You're just gonna want to let it air dry, or if you want, you could use a towel to make the process quicker. So I'm just gonna 